Welcome to the Restless Recluse. And this video we will be on another road trip. We will be heading from Vancouver Island up to Terrace, British Columbia, about uh, 17 hours north of here, or 1500 kilometers, as the road lays, not as the crow flies. And possibly even a trip to the Queen Charlotte Islands. We will see. Um, I'm up on a work project, probably the last one of my career, so I thought it would be good to capture the moment. So, stick around and hopefully we'll see some interesting stuff. Well, it's day two, and I spent last night in Quenelle. I'm currently in Prince George, on my way west now to Terrace. Behind me you can see Mr. P.G., famous mascot of Prince George, British Columbia. It's at the crossroads of Highway 16 West and Highway 97 North and South, so very busy intersection. Lots of heavy industrial traffic. It is Tuesday, July 7th, for the noonish. I'm settled in Terrace and I have gotten my work list. So I will plot away through that this evening, but I thought I'd get a crack on it this morning and tackle some of these bridges. So it looks like I'll be heading up north to uh, King Polith, New Anch, and you'll be coming along for that ride. And hopefully seeing some of the Niska lava beds and some other sites, maybe a bear or two. We will see. In the meantime, I will try to first my little monologue to a bit more road footage, but I know how boring that can be. So take care and we will catch up soon.
I've come to the end of the road. The village of Kinkolas is about 10 kilometers that way. I drove to the boundary and then turned around because they're limiting it to residents only and I don't need to be one of those asshole tourists who wants to stick his nose in where he's not welcome. But this is the Pacific Ocean right here. This is all the Pacific Northwest of British Columbia. Old logging scars and a lot of um, unexplored wilderness as well still. You can see the tides way out and it is an absolutely gorgeous day, although we had a little bit of rain earlier. Hope you're enjoying the trip so far. It's Thursday and tomorrow I'll be futzing around in a town of Terrace itself. And then we'll have the weekend and I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do up here for entertainment. So enjoy the view. We are atop Bornite Mountain. It is noon on Sunday, July 12th. Nutka and I just finished a really steep uh, two and three quarter climb trail. Uh, up here from the trailhead. I got a lot sweatier and a lot more breathless than I thought I did. Apparently I need to do more cardio. But we're the only people up here, probably the only people for miles around. It's socked in, but it's not raining, not even misting. It's absolutely beautiful. There's not a sound to be heard. The dog is in her element, sniffing everything and rolling in the snow. I just finished a couple of peanut butter sandwiches and I'm going to relax for a little bit and contemplate the wilderness before we head back down. It's nice to get out of that truck and out from underneath bridges and not drive somewhere for a change and to really stretch my legs. It's absolutely beautiful up here in the Pacific Northwest and if you ever get the opportunity, I strongly encourage you to get up here and see it, despite the long distance it takes to get here. Once more, checking in, and I just came out of the town of Stewart. Behind me you can see the Bear Glacier, which is just off Highway 37A. It's about a three hour trip north from Terrace, but Stewart has always been one of my favorite towns in British Columbia. It's isolated, it's small. I think this whole valley should be a national park, um, but be that as it may, it's um, always had a bit of appeal, and I actually gave serious thought to 
retiring here, even though it's so far away from everything else, or maybe because it's so far away from everything else. As you can see, they're sites you certainly never get tired of, um, of being around. We're going to have a spot of lunch, the dog and I, and then we will make our way back to Terrace, which is about three hours south of here. Hopefully see some bears along the way. Thank you.